Hello, YouTubers. It's Travis. Welcome back for another brawl. I have for you today a, a comp that no one's talking about in the new patch. It's always been there. It's still there and still seems fine to me. I don't think it's busted, but there's things you can do at the top end and it can kill a pumpkin or two. Maybe not all of them, but some of them. Uh, so for today, I'll say maybe we could be royals. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you like what you're seeing, please do consider subscribing and uh, maybe leave a comment down below. Let me know that you were picking up what I'm putting down, as they say. I uh, hope that you enjoy this brawl. I haven't played Sphinx on the new patch. Probably not going to here either. It was like when Yorm works, it's the best thing. Okay. I don't think the patch is entirely explored, but it's probably quite explored. I've been buying less uh, early happy little trees than I used to. I'm still going to do it here, but like, trees just ain't as good as they was. Sphinx was interesting with the two spell slots. I feel like it's just a bad Peter Pants now. Well, he may be vulnerable inside because of his emotions, but his outside is all scaly and hard, so I don't think Jorm's actually that vulnerable. What buy? I feel like Fanny has the upside, the highest upside. I'm going to buy her. Uh, the text, the Sphinx hasn't changed much. Um, it just lost a spell slot. When you level up, your spells are free. For that turn. I'm not going to buy an egg. I want to start building things. This is the reason I wanted to buy Fanny, is because if we bump into another dwarf, all of a sudden we're doing better things. There's a lot of things in this pack I want. It's like, I don't have to force mages. I'm pretty bloody tempted to. Like, that's a mighty fine start. And you've got GS and Lance and Double Baba. Yeah. That may have been too late for me to buy be buying the cat, but... I'm supposed to win the early game with all my stats. Where are they? This sucks. I'm gonna take damage again. You in the same lobby and you're doing terrible? Not as terrible as me. What are you playing, Boros? You playing this? This broke rather well for us, but I'll take it. Yeah, that was well. It was a fifty-fifty, so I guess a fifty-fifty breaking our way kind of is what it is.
Earthquake will still do something here. So will this uh, stag. Could sell this by that, have a 5-5. Five, five. Like, that's realistic stats. All right, it's something. You want to believe? I can believe. I, I, I don't think I would believe, except we're going against Sad Dracula. So we're not attacking first. So we may as well try to have some, like, a one in four for the stag to survive. And then I... Never mind. We just earthquake them into a, a whole new world. What's the weather like down there? In wherever this earthquake took you? We killed them so hard we didn't even get to slay with our princess. Seems good, man. All right, you want stats? You got stats. Have some stats. Fairy tale sold. Don't really want the HLT anymore. We've gone all the way through three and haven't found a way to do anything with it. So I'm certainly not locking for it. This is probably the last turn I have any consideration playing her. Half a meter of snow. That sounds terrible. Yeah, maybe we maybe it's worth the gold to speculate. That's not crazy. That's not crazy. I do like a good pig. I think it's like a foot and a half wallet. Or maybe like 1.2 feet. Classic pan shadow dwarves. One point six four feet. Okay, so it was a foot and a half. Yep. Suddenly evil. Suddenly Sporco. I also take the bad moon. We're right on four, but I think I want Mep. I want Sporco. I want whatever this is. Let's see what else you got. Ooh, hello, ladies. Again, there's some Grim Soul action going on, but I do like Ladies of the Lake for ranged units. We might be heading to Mageville. I like where this is headed. It does sound like a good dog. Oh, hello, Ravis. Did you just get that sting? Because it looks like it's going to kill me. Because if you weren't stable, you're incredibly stable now. Poodle D and Sting's kind of dumb. I 
I think I'd like to at least get a six off of this, and I'm in a position to do that. But I, I'd take a five. Let's be real. I still don't want the tree. I don't think I want the tree for very long. I mean, my character buff does want me to cast this. How, how strong do you reckon Nah Hattery is? And what do you think I can do with the gold? I'd even like a monster book, y'all. Like a lot. Yeah, there's too many things I want to hit. That's pretty decent stats. I mean, it is a dragon meta, and that is a free spell, but we'll we'll move along. What's going on ranged units is pretty bananas. Chonk. Just that uh, it's mostly me teasing Boros. The dragons are quite good. The lightning dragons are quite good this patch. Whereas last patch, they were not very good. That's all I mean. It, it, and it's mostly me joking a bit. What wizard's interesting, but I, I still feel like I'm headed to Mageville on the Mageville Express. Not really to Sleeping Princess Phil, though. Dang it, I could have had eight of them by now, but I still don't want any of them. It's just here for a minute. Okay, Sporko would like to stick around. But that's an awkward spot. This is the world's most expensive Sporko. But I'll take it. We're up against a trophy hunter who's taken very little damage. That's gonna hurt. They'd be taking out all my range. I can see why they haven't taken any damage. And we're even feeding him a lance sly. All right. If I don't see an Aeon soon, I need to come up with another plan. Save me a giant treasure. Spear of Achilles with ranged units. Done. Really makes me want to lock for this uh, port wizard. I'm going to completely, basically, completely shift what we're doing. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. 
Spear's pretty dang good, eh? I'm sure I'll take it, but I'm not even convinced it plays. Don't mind runestones. It's like this is just better than anything else I could be presenting. Okay, fine. I am now interested in this. Pan was on dwarves last time we saw him, so I don't want to fire off a of falling stars. They have an angry on board. It probably helps them more than it hurts them. Like zero attack princess first. The problem is she's not zero attack because of the fairy tale. I think I'd rather just have the ranged unit. I mean, she's arguably better than this. But fair enough. But... some big dwarfs. Court wizard's gonna have to do triple time. There we go. No more pain. I don't really want any of this. There's a couple fours I'd like to hit, though, so I'm going to spin one of these. That it isn't one of them. Like, there's a world where I eventually want Arthur. I'm just not there yet. I probably should have taken the lance looking by. Yeah, I most certainly should have. Okay, this is good. We want this. I really need a way to get it back here, but I kind of can't yet. We'll sort this out next turn. Well, it's also kind of a good boy waiting room for a minute, right? Like... shenanigans going to we could take eight like being at 10 isn't the worst and we know we're probably beating pan i should have bought that lance though i don't think i need a pig to beat pan oh th no this is a different one this is peter pants okay we played him three turns ago and got him perk actually works here this is never coming in I really need this court wizard in the back. Let's do that. It just feels weird not to have the support, you know? I 
I would be willing to buy a good boy. It's a decent enough spell, and frankly, these are never coming in. But let's just do what we got to do here. The spear's falling off a little bit, which I don't care for. I was supposed to find a good boy, but I did. then I didn't. Don't have to worry about pants for a little bit. Hey, it's that card I was talking about that I wanted. All right, cool. Let's win. I would like to find a good spell to put on it. And then to win the video game. That's good enough. Yeah, that works too. I kind of want the lance over this, but I'd have to sell my whole board for it. What was the pants board? Trying to find hat ball, but didn't find it. Getting Lance in against a ghost is nice. Kind of. I think I actually want this here. Like, it's certainly better than the princess, but... Okay, so you want to do that and sell our board off for it? Let's try it. We could get a level 7 treasure off of Herc, but we'll see. You don't think so? We would have this fight. But it's our obviously fairy tale and uh, rune stones need to go. So let's let's get them. We've got two. I would need a three for arc, and there's a three. Two, three, four, five, six. That seems really good. Sure. I just do this and we've got infinite stats and more royals. What is my five? Lance? I do like Lance a lot. Pig? That may legitimately be our only chance. So, let's go pick club. Put Fiona in seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yes, I like this. I was going to ask you, Raptors Gate, if you ever went to that uh, taquito place I was telling you about between Awatuki and Tempe, next to Safeway, because I remember we talked about it, but then I don't remember if you ever went or told me about it. But I thought about it yesterday. It was like, next time I see Raptors Gate, I'm going to ask him. I do like Lance a lot. Man, we almost had that. Almost had that. I think we can probably secure a second, though, because we will be pants. Unless their board has changed dramatically. 
What are we looking for? Mainly spells to buff the good boy. These are not spells to buff the good boy. A little bit of time wouldn't hurt either. I mean, that's certainly better than Fiona, but like, I can't keep the arc going with that. I don't think I can play this either. Yeah, our, our, well, I could play it over Herc, but Herc triggers these dudes. Yeah, this is awkward, dude. I can't really improve this board much. Short of spells. Let's roll for the spells. These are decent spells. Were they the dwarf board? No. They were a Darkwood Creeper board randomly. Yeah, I think I'd rather have the Core Wizard attack. That's fair. If you ever do go check that place out, it's a delight. I ain't sure we can beat the trophy hunter. But second place feels pretty good. I can dig it. I'm pretty happy being Merlin unless we dream into Gwen and Ty. That's a lot. It's a lot to expect. Don't want this. I don't remember the name of it. That was the rough part, right? I can tell you about where it is. Let's find a pig. That's about all I need now, right? How big do you get? Not big enough. Guess we'll put a bunch of attack here. Sort of anything else to do. But so know it's at a Safeway shopping center between Awatuki and Tempe. What would you want an evil twin? I'll Google it in a minute and we'll find it. Yeah, it's it's not crazy to evil twin the good boy. The thing is that like that's an eight cost good boy. We could roll into a six cost one, but the arc does make upgrades tough. I, I don't think we're beating this trophy hunter board though. Like I'm just I'm not scaling to this level uh, with the uh, spear of Achilles. I think this is about the best we can do, but I'll take it. Like, that ain't so bad. We're moving in the right direction. We're moving in the right direction. Their numbers do go bigger. It's true. And, of course, a big thank you to my patrons. Paul, Punk, Hero, Joe, Jesse, Jacob, Scott, Basti, Rich, Michael, Brandon, John, and Jazzy. Thank you very much. We'll see you soon.